Jam. It was where the bull looks at uh, Ronald McDonald. <laughs> Other than my own short film that I animated myself with Bill Plimpton guiding me. <laughs> drawing was great. I thought it wasn't really that good, but it was good enough to get me into this amazing film project, animating this film. Wow. What, what do you think you learned from, from doing this? I learned how to do animation and also many different techniques. There you go. And also I learned a little bit about storytelling. Ah, which is very important in the producing world too. That's great. Good for you. Okay, so now what kind of research did you do while making this film? Uh, well, some things I researched online and other things I researched on um, documents that the director, Kevin, gave me. Now, why do you think it's important for other kids to learn about the Holocaust and what do you hope to achieve with your film for them? Uh, well, I hope to make them aware of what happened there so that it would never be repeated again in history. Wow, that's important. And I heard this is your first time of collaborating with a kid, Mr. Yeah. Perry Chen here. What was your role? Well, I did the, uh, the, the storyboards. I, uh, uh, Kevin showed me the script. And I did, uh, I think, about 15 storyboards, and then Perry animated each uh, each frame of the uh, animation. Oh, that's so great! How exciting! How did you like the end result? I think it's wonderful. It's very charming, very marvelous, very powerful story, and uh, I think it'll do very well. So, what is your advice uh, for other young aspiring animators like Perry? Uh, to draw all the time. Always have a pencil in your hand. I always carry three or four pencils with me, and I'm always drawing. Uh, what's your name and what do you do? My name is Dr. Joe Bussell, Joseph. I was at the Holocaust. I was in ghetto Warsaw in Poland, and uh, I survived the war. And I'm very proud that you did this movie. Very, very proud because your mom was telling me about it. Thanks. And it, for me, it's also an honor to talk with you because we need to educate from children, everyone, about the Holocaust. Why do you think it's important to educate kids about the Holocaust? Because some people don't believe that Holocaust took place, you see? But all my family, almost all my family was killed during the Holocaust by the Germans. And therefore, we don't want that it will happen to any other people in the world. And whoever doesn't understand it, he really doesn't deserve anything. Okay? Well, thanks for, uh, thanks for talking with me. Oh, absolutely. I enjoyed too.